What is up, Nuggets? It's your boy, Killer Pizza, here with a brand new video for you rascals and rapscallions out there. Hopefully everybody's doing good and the world is treating you well. I know I am slowly but surely recovering from the sprained elbow. It is feeling a lot better. Not 100% yet, but hopefully we get there sooner than later. And aside from a little bit of a last-minute blizzard here in Michigan, all is good on my end of the screen over here. So anyways, on to the video at hand. This is kind of an impromptu video. I wasn't planning on making this. But I said, why not do a little bit of an unboxing or an unbagging, if you will, because I have a bag from Gutter Garbs. They are a company that makes horror merch, a bunch of horror t-shirts and whatnot. There are so many companies out there that make really badass horror merch. And I believe they had a sale going on at the time that I placed my order. I don't really remember because this was like almost two months ago. And my dumbass didn't realize one of the shirts I picked up was a pre-order. So I had to wait for that to be released to get all my other stuff. You know how that goes sometimes. Don't you hate that shit? But anyways, let's open this right up. If you guys have ever grabbed from Gutter Garbs, let me know what you think. Nice packaging. Got everything separately. Oh, all black t-shirts. Some uh, weirdo. But uh, anyways, where to begin? So three out of the five of these are just straight up uh, like poster title, like poster artwork of these actual films. So nothing too flashy with these. Like I said, I believe a lot of these were on sale. So I picked them up. So first one we got, the classic artwork of Tales from the Dark Side. Now did anybody upgrade to 4k through screen factory for this one i know i didn't i think it's different when i have some of these uh titles with the slip when i got them brand new i mean when you release the uh 4k so soon after and everything but yeah tales from the dark side i love this movie very very underrated anthology the final uh segment or skit whatever with the gargoyle i think the guy right on the front that is one of the best segments in any horror anthology film i'll put it up there with any of them kind of a sad ending and whatnot but i love tales from the dark side all right next up speaking of movies i got through screen factory that i didn't upgrade to 4k because i was i bought the uh blu-ray when it came out the alternate slip and you know some movies don't need to be upgraded you know this looks just fine uh, this is a very underrated movie, in my opinion. My Bloody Valentine. And I love that original artwork. Did I say Valentine? Valentine. But absolutely love this movie. Uh, the, underrated, uh, the unrated version is much, much better, though. I'll tell you what. But I think this is a movie that doesn't get talked about as much with other slashers. But My Bloody Valentine. I love that movie. Uh, if anybody picked up the 4K, let me know. Did it actually look good? Like, how good did it look? All right. And this is honestly the shirt I was most excited about in the order. Look at that. Class of 1984. How badass is that? It almost looks like a, like a Clash t-shirt. The band The Clash, one of my favorite bands of all time. What was it saying here? We are the future and nothing can stop us. Class of 1984. I think that's badass. I watched Class of 1984 for the first time. Maybe in, in the past six months was my first time watching it. What a crazy fucking movie, I'll tell you guys. Class of 1984. If you've never seen it before... Not what is what what I was expecting. Uh, really, really good movie about these kids that just push the teacher to the limit, like in this lawless high school and everything. These rebellious punk rock kids, and they take it much further than I ever expected them to take it in that movie. Uh, absolutely loved it. Class of nineteen eighty four, and this is one of my favorite uh, artworks, like for a movie poster. Guess what that is? Black Christmas. So I love this movie. This is one that I did upgrade to 4K on when it came out. I watched it this past Christmas. 
one of the greatest slasher movies of all time, one of the original slasher movies of all time. It's either this or like Bay of Blood or the originals. And this doesn't get as much credit as it deserves compared to like how people give Halloween, you know, most of the credit for the original slasher. But Black Christmas is great. And that 4K upgrade was amazing. It just, you know, all the snow and in the winter time, Christmas time. Uh, here's the one that held everything up, damn it. And if my sister is watching, she is going to be jealous of this one right here. House of a Thousand Corpses. I just really like the color on this. I thought that was really badass. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of House of a Thousand Corpses. I mean that in regard of, like, if you're a fan of wrestling, I use The Undertaker as an example all the time. I can't say I'm a huge Undertaker fan because the people that are are, like, diehard. These are their number one favorites. So it's like the people that love House of a Thousand Corpses are, like, Die Hard, they absolutely love it, and I really like it too, but I wouldn't say I'm like the biggest fan, but I thought that shirt, the design, the colors was badass. Captain Spaulding. Wish I could have met him, man. But yeah, this is a badass shirt too. The most shocking tales of Carnage you will ever see. So yep, those are the five shirts I picked up. I got Tales from the Dark Side, My Bloody Valentine, Class of 1984, Black Christmas and House of a Thousand Corpses. So hopefully you guys dig the pickups, the shirts. You know, I just figured I'd make a video out of this anyways, but I got two more videos coming today. I pumped them all out. You know, I was going to release this one earlier on Saturday, but it's a little bit later on a Saturday as I'm recording this, and I didn't want to put it out too late. So I'm going to have my Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice trailer reaction coming out maybe an hour or so after this comes out. And then my review of Christine. I'm about to watch it for the first time in a matter of minutes, really. I'm going to edit this video, upload it, uh, at least schedule it, and I'll probably pop in Christine. And I actually think after that, after Christine, I'm going to check this out, the 4K Total Recall. So, and I thought about a movie from here. I don't know. We will see where my night goes. I plan on getting about four movies in tonight at the time of recording but anyways like i said hopefully everybody's having a good one i will catch you in about an hour or so with my beetlejuice beetlejuice trailer reaction other than that blood gut score i'll check you guys next time